And we are back. Fresh Direct is committed to fostering strong relationships with its local partners. Now, throughout the month of August, they've been celebrating Local Month, showcasing and backing various New York area brands spanning from newcomers to long-standing favorites, including farmers, growers, distillers, and food producers. Joining me now and sharing more is the produce category manager of Fresh Direct, Mary S. Mitchell. And Mary, thank you for being with us. It's uh, an exciting time for Fresh Direct. Uh, August, as we said, uh, local partners and uh, finding out about some of the great local talent that we have here in our state. Absolutely. Thank you so much for having me, Darren. It's really an honor to talk to you. Uh, so yeah, like you said, Fresh Direct is really committed to our local partners. Um, from the very beginning, from the very foundation of Fresh Direct, we've prioritized quality and flavor above everything. And so how do you get the very best quality and flavor to customers. It's you shorten the supply chain. You work directly with as many producers, growers, uh, as you said, all of these artisans um, directly with them. And so uh, we're, we're lucky to be here in the Bronx. So we're close to so many available, really wonderful and unique uh, brands and growers. And when we talk about brands and growers, we're right across the state. I think we just drive by them. If you, if you venture out of the city, go up a state a little bit, you'll find there's so many various people that are out there that have some great things that they could offer to uh, New Yorkers. And when we talk about local growers, I, I wanted to talk about some frozen treats because I think that so many people uh, in this day and age, it's hot, it's summer, and looking for frozen treats, but there are great frozen treats out there that have actually been uh, produced by some uh, local vendors. Yeah, absolutely. Record heats this summer, right? So yeah. um, we've got we've got Chloe's, which is um, you know a woman owned frozen treat here uh, in Manhattan. We've got um, they're really they're amazing. Their strawberry pops are actually one of my favorites, like a regular staple. Um, then we've got uh, what Adirondack Creamery, which they just have the most unique flavors. Um, their ice cream is so delicious, and that's another that's another really great local treat here. Yeah. And then we talk about bread. I mean, there's organic bread that's out there as well. And uh, I know we've got bread alone. What can you tell us about bread alone? Bread alone is really unique. Um, they have uh, they have a new compostable packaging, um, which really helps with our sustainability mission. That's something we're really passionate about here as well. Um, you know, my background is in produce, and I, I worked at the Union Square Green Market before I was here, and I used to shop reg bread alone regularly. They're just they're an amazing group of people, an amazing group of bakers, and it's really a treat to have them available on our site. When you talk about shoppers, obviously, there's the, the, they're the staples, the go-to brands that they're out there. But shoppers sometimes don't always venture towards local vendors. But you guys do a great job of really highlighting them. Are you finding that more and more shoppers are gravitating towards these local vendors and really bringing them home? Yeah, definitely. I think that there's still so much disconnect in your regular grocery shopping between like people don't always know where their food is coming from um, to begin with. So, you know, I don't know if, if everyone knows how much produce moves throughout the world or across the country and how much better it tastes when there's a farmer that's actually harvesting your tomato or your corn this morning and is going to be delivered to you, you know, tonight or tomorrow morning. Um, it makes a huge difference. And I think that especially at Fresh Direct, we do a really great job job of communicating that to our customers. And so that education piece is like, wow, why is that so much better? And it's because, you know, it's grown right here and you're getting it the day after it's picked or the day it's picked in some cases. Yeah. Uh, uh, share with me a little bit. Uh, when we talk about farms, we think about going upstate a little bit and you know there's some great farms up there. Uh, travel up to Milton, New York. We know that there's Hepworth Farms up there and they're doing some great stuff. So tell our viewers about what's going on at Hepworth, uh, at, uh, Hepworth Farms. Yeah, Hepworth Farms uh, is a multi-generational family farm. Um, they've been in operation over 200 years. It's currently run by two twin sisters, um, and they just do an amazing job with an array of vegetables, but particularly their tomatoes. are. Um, they've got you know over 20 varieties, probably even more, uh, and they're just delicious and amazing products. Um, and so we've got... Um, We've got tomatoes, we've got peppers, we've got eggplants, we've got all of these like summer staples for you that they're bringing to us three times a week um, directly from about two hours north of the city. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, one of my favorite spots is New York. Uh, there's some hummus up there that you want to tell us about. <laughs> 
Ithaca hummus, right? It's delicious. I don't know as much about the background of Ithaca hummus, but mm -hmm. um, I do know that I'm very picky about hummus, and that's one that's really nice. When I see it around the office, I'm like, that's a go-to. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, New York yeah. is getting ready right now for its state fair that's taking place upstate New York, where all of New York State gathers. And one of the things that uh, is a staple at New York State Fair is the corn. Uh, and I know that Fresh Direct has uh, some very special corn that they're highlighting as well uh, through some of their local vendors. Talk to us about that. Absolutely. So John Altabelli uh, of Altabelli Family Farms grows corn exclusively for Fresh Direct, and he works closely with uh, Cornell University. So he's always trialing and growing um, really new sweet flavors and uh, like longer lasting corn as well. And so um, he carries his season well into October. We're shooting for November this year, um, but he grows uh, all of our all of our corn. It's the sweetest. You can eat it raw. Um, it's really the sweetest corn and it's grown by the sweetest people. So he's actually harvesting that this morning for delivery this afternoon. So anyone, um, you know, it doesn't get more fresh than that. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's really well, special. Well, I mean, yes, I mean that's farm that, that that's <laughs> farm to store like immediately. So usually afterwards, you know, you you figure like, hey, it might be a little time frame in between, but this is actually farm to store, and that's and that and that's actually great. Uh, before we go, uh, what do you want our viewers to know in terms of uh, upcoming things? Oh my gosh! Well, I think one of the um, main things that I want to share with customers is that we've chosen August to be our highlight for local month because there is just like such a diversity of items across all categories available mm -hmm. uh, locally. But really, we strive to source with our neighbors year round. So a lot of these things and a lot of these um, farms are growing for us, whether it be uh, pumpkins and apples in the next couple of months to some of those hardier like roots and squash and uh, things throughout the winter, um, all the way through the the spring so year round we have and then and then into your your regular grocery brands right like roasted coffees like we were talking about the bakeries the frozen treats um the salads salads dressings gotham greens is right here you know uh, very close by so um we have that those local those really delicious things available for you year round uh, mary we gotta leave it there but i want to thank you so much for joining us i think uh, i'm hungry now and i still got a show to do so thanks a lot for like getting me uh you know in this place of hunger i'm gonna try and manage and make it thanks a lot for being with us <laughs> absolutely thank you so much all righty you take care listen now if you want you more too. information visit the website freshdirect.com and then follow them on social media at fresh direct don't go anywhere we're gonna take a break long enough for me to get something to eat <laughs> we'll be right back right after this <laughs> 